What's up, everyone? This is Max Red. Today, we're going to cover some ways to make your beats hit harder and louder. If you're sharing your beats with artists or playing them in a club, you definitely want to stand out in terms of volume and perceived loudness. As a disclaimer, these tips are not meant to replace proper mixing and mastering, but are simply meant to boost your mixes and beats in order to stand out and gain more attention. So let's get started. So here I have this drum loop that I created for a beat that I worked on recently. Let's listen to it. The first thing I like to do is make sure that I have a brick wall limiter on the last slot of my master fader. I want to prevent any unwanted clipping. I also set it at minus 1 dB. That's a good level for streaming. Next, we need to place a metering or visual aid on our channel so we can see the changes. For this, we'll use supervision with the wave scope feature. Next, we open up Soft Clipper and begin applying dynamics to our mix. The Soft Clipper rounds out the peaks of our audio and will add some distortion to the mix as well. The upper settings include the input, the output, and the mix level. The lower settings let you apply Soft Clipper to the second and third harmonics of your mix. Let's apply it in real time and listen to the changes. At this point, we made our track hit harder, but we can squeeze a little bit more out of it by adding the maximizer. You could also use the limiter, but the maximizer has some features that I like better for this. We can boost our track up one or two dB at a time, and it also has a soft clipper feature. So now let's hear our drum loop with both soft clipper and maximizer applied. Now we're going to apply the same process to the entire beat. Let's hear it. We'll start with the soft clipper first and hear those changes. In order to visually check our work, we'll bounce out the audio with the plugins applied and compare the waveforms. Like I said before, this doesn't substitute proper mixing, but it can definitely help make your tracks louder. That's all I have for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you haven't, and leave a comment to see others like it. Thank you.